Now the race for the White House. Hillary Clinton saying she'll be the nominee while slamming Donald Trump, calling him not qualified to be president as she climbs back to the top in a new national poll. ABC's Tom Yamas is here with the latest. Good morning, Tom. Robin, good morning to you. Donald Trump and Hillary Clinton in a back and forth that is still going on this morning. Trump just tweeting that ISIS wants Hillary to be president. Overnight, Donald Trump taking a short trip across the river and feeling right at home in New Jersey. There's nothing like New Jersey. Uh, wise guys, so many wise guys. Raising money with Governor Chris Christie and wasting no time going after Hillary Clinton. For her to be able to continue to run is an absolute disgrace, in my opinion, to this country. But Clinton telling CNN she is going to go all the way. I will be the nominee for my party, Chris. That, oh, yeah. that, is, that is already done, in effect. There is no way that uh, I won't be. And as for her GOP opponent, Clinton says Trump is the one not fit for the White House. I think if you go through many of his irresponsible, reckless, dangerous comments, it's not just somebody saying something off the cuff. I have concluded he is not qualified to be president of the United States. But Trump says his dire predictions on issues like terror validate him. Convinced terrorists took down the Egypt air flight, announcing it on Twitter as the news broke of the plane's disappearance. What just happened about 12 hours ago? A plane got blown out of the sky. And if anything, if anybody thinks it wasn't blown out of the sky, you're 100% wrong, folks, okay? And replaying his foreign policy promises. When Carrier and Ford and Nabisco leaving Chicago with their big plant, they're moving to Mexico. I'm not eating Oreos anymore, you know that. But neither is Chris. You're not eating Oreos anymore. No more Oreos for either of us, Chris. Don't feel bad for either of us. A lot of people talking about that Oreo joke this morning. And Hillary Clinton trying to get in the last word in this fight, tweeting also last night, if you cite supporting torture and hosting pageants as foreign policy qualifications, your definition needs work. George and Robin? It's me. Yeah, she <laughs> got a long way to go still. We certainly mm -hmm. do.